Did Davido provoke Whiskey at uh, London's restaurant? That is the question I'm really asking because a video of that is really trending on social media. I think we need to dive into the story but before we dive in proper i want to say thank you guys for watching our videos and thank you for the love so far if you are new here you can click the subscribe button below and the bell notification icon to always get notifications each time we upload our videos a new challenge has started about davido's uh, dodo and that is really interesting but right now davido is asking and saying that who started off or created the challenge that is what it is and he said he's gonna learn the challenge for real that is what is coming in from davido at the time a lot of people are really responding to davido at a time like this i think uh, based on the history based on the stories you know coming out davido whiskey these guys they are really going to trend to november down to december that is what it is now because anybody dropping an album right now outside davido and we Kid, these guys are not going to do massive numbers so you have to delay a bit for their story to die down before you can put your own particular you know work out there because a lot of people believe that david o and whiskey these guys are the biggest two afrobeat artists you know based on what we have about them we have the lies of burner boy joining them to become the big three and a lot of persons are saying that we should leave out big four because rema is trying to claim the spot what do you feel about the story of rema do you think rema deserves to be called a big four i want you to put your own opinion in the comment section if you feel that should be the case of rema but i feel that rema needs to go back to the drawing board and do a lot and prove himself because right now we have the music industry being saturated with the lies of ashake with the lies of omali with the lies of her terms irasta and a lot of persons and these guys are doing massive numbers at that as we await grammy nominations next month a lot of people are really excited that their own faith actually submitted their own you know kind of songs and works for the grammy we have the lies of ashake you know submitting for five categories and we got the lies of uh, you know a lot of persons like uh davido having submissions we have a uh, burner boy co-submitting with somebody and we got a lot of persons and what are your own takes about this story i want you to put your own comments in the comment section so that you can have a glimpse at that davido is joining dodo challenge and dodo is one of davido's old songs in the past and this song is coming back to life right now and somebody has started challenge on it what are your own takes about that davido has promised that he's going to learn the challenge and ask him who started off the challenge i think he's going to reward the person that is something i believe about all of this story what are your own takes about this don't forget to put your own opinion in the comment section so that you can have a proper glimpse at what you feel so far pastor toby a close associate of davido has actually spoken out and a lot of people can really understand his own point of view remember that a video of pastor toby and davido at a place that looks like a club where you know kind of uh, whiskey actually came to eat also uh, really escalated on social media a lot of people were calling out the pastor how would he be going clubbing with the likes of davido that is dining and whining with sinners and the rest and some people have to actually protect pastor toby with a particular verse of the bible that is uh, matthew 11 19 and a lot of people got to understand the big story but right now this pastor is coming out to speak about all of this and somehow we are getting to understand his own point of view a lot of people were quick to judge him and god never made them judge and that is something i got to understand the lies of Bucci and others came out to write a lot of things about this pastor claiming that he's not a pastor for being a friend of the video and the rest but he is coming out to say you know what um, me the video we actually went out to eat and then we have whiskey also came out to eat in london and you know something escalated and the rest but something actually struck somebody drew our attention to the whole story remember that uh davido was at the restaurant and then whiskey came by and then whiskey decided to leave the restaurant because he was not comfortable with davido's uh, you know crew and the rest 
that really, really disturbed at the time and Pastor Toby was really called out. And now somebody is drawing our attention to a lot of things that in 2017, Whiskey actually did something which was recreated by David o at that event, you know, at that restaurant. Is it what provoked uh, Whiskey? That is the question I'm really asking. I think we need to catch a glimpse of this. What are your own takes about this? What is your own feeling about all of this? I want you to put your own opinion in the comment section because a lot of people are really responding to this story and the video is all out. You can subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the subscribe button below and the bell notification icon to always get more of these kind of juicy stories. One thing you need to understand about that is a lot of people are trying to like, you know, link up the chain reactions and the rest and saying that you know that could have provoked whiskey because whiskey was found doing it in 2017 and now the video is doing it to whiskey is it what actually provoked whiskey that is the question a lot of persons are really asking right now and whiskey storming out of the club after that went to social media and started posting and then talking about the video but the video's men responded to whiskey but till now the video has not responded to whiskey that is what a lot of people are getting to understand what is your own take about this don't fail to put that in the comment section also i want you to understand that a lot of people actually blasted the pastor toby on this until he came out to say that was not a club it was a restaurant and we are getting to understand the big story from that you know point of view and now some people are getting to understand uh, the uh, reason why Whiskey must have left that particular you know restaurant maybe because <laughs> the video now troublemaker that is what a lot of people are saying but some people are saying that is not enough to actually provoke person at all that is what I want in my comment section I want your own opinion so that we can really Take a look at what you believe about uh, the story so far. David O, Whiskey, Burner Boy, these guys remain the biggest Afrobeat artist right now based on what we have on our records. Somebody is trying to join them as Big Four. Do you think Rema has proved himself to become Big Four? I want you to put that also in the comment section. Before I jump off, I want to say thank you guys for watching our videos and thank you for the love so far. If you are new here, you can click the subscribe button below and the bell notification icon to always get notifications each time we upload our videos i love you guys keep supporting afrobeat blog